Okay guys, we have our delivery, uh, the first part of it anyway. It's okay, I just wanted to, I'm, I'm uh, chronicling the whole construction process. Oh, I got you. Okay. So I'm just uh, showing your delivery. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. You got more? Uh, yeah, I'm bringing uh, eight pallets and uh, two bits of sand. And is this the mortar stuff? Yeah. Okay, cool. Thank you. Thank you. We're going to watch. No problem. Thanks. Okay, there he goes. We'll check him when he gets back. Okay, so he's coming back up the driveway with the second pallet, and it is 7.15 on Wednesday morning the 19th. So, oh, this is a bigger, bigger pallet load. I think all the rest will probably be this size. And like I said, the uh, mason is supposed to be here either Friday or Monday, so we'll see. I'm glad my neighbors don't mind this happening. <laughs> it is a little bit noisy for this early in the morning. Well, that little forklift moves pretty quickly. All right, I'm, I'll wait until everything's delivered and show you the last one. So that's how they deliver the sand to mix the mortar. That's pretty ingenious. They can bring everything all at one time. Pretty cool. Here in just a minute, um, I've got one of the blocks out here. I pulled one off the pallet. There are 16 high, uh, eight inches thick, and about a foot wide. So I'm gonna put it on the scale and show you what it weighs. Let's see what happens here. pounds each definitely masonry is a young man's job that's that's for sure anyway let's take a quick look over here here's our pile of sand here's a mortar and then I think he said he had eight pallets of these so so far we have one two three four back in a few Okay, here comes the last load, as I understand it. It's another bucket of sand for mortar mixing. And I'm gonna catch the whole method that this gets dumped from the beginning this time. It slides the door open and then he starts shaking it around a little bit. Here we go. That's a lot of sand. Wiggle the door shut so he's got to reopen it.
So thanks for delivering everything. What was your name? My name's Chris. And Chris, you work for Cabco, is Central that right? Central Trucking, a division of Cabco. Central Trucking, division of Cabco. And for those that don't know, Cabco stands for Central Arizona Block Company. Is that correct? That's correct. And uh, out of curiosity, is this a cubic yard of sand in this bucket? There's actually a yard and a half. A yard and a half in, in a bucket this size here. Let me show everybody. There you go. A yard and a half. So three yards of sand, basically, and all these pallets of blocks. Well, hey, Chris, thank you very much. Hey, thank you very much, Bart. Good Appreciate it. Project and have a good time. Yep, check it out online. Okay, bye-bye. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good day. You too. All right, there goes Chris. Okay, just to wrap it up, we've got eight pallets of blocks, two are smaller. Um, six full pallets so that comes out to about 660 blocks and at 47.4 uh, pounds each that's 31,000 pounds and that would be about eight tons and then we have three yards of mortar sand here and a partial pallet of mortar mix so that is uh, what we have for the next phase, which is to um, build the block wall on these footings out here. And then we will be filling in and uh, compacting everything. And then uh, up here we'll be digging the footings, the other two sh shallow footings right here and right here. Uh, and then pouring the footings in the floor at the same time. Our Mason is a Klein, Mike Klein from Klein Masonry out of Tucson. He said he would be here either Friday or Monday, so I'm hoping for Friday, but we'll see what happens. Thanks for watching.